subscribe button also i would love for you guys to become a channel member all of my channel members i will be going live today pd society circle this sunday we're going to be talking about sorcery yes black magic yeah we're going to know the devices of satan around here because we're going to know how to fight him right also single and ready series may 18th we're only eight days away you do not want to miss this you have to be prepared because the marriages are so here okay family i cannot stress it enough <laughs> single and ready series we have our bible study group if you would like to sign up for that email prophetic diary of truth and uh, any other announcements yes I have some summer drops on keepwindesist.com. I just dropped some really, really cute sets that you're going to love so much. You're going to stand out, look cute this summer. So check it all out, keepwindesist.com. And also our community page for more information. I am in 1 Corinthians 9, 24. And it reads, do you not know that in a race, all runners run, but only one receives the prize so the run so run that you may obtain it and we all have been running a good race right we have all really stuck through in those times when our legs was given out and we were so tired and so many people dropped off so many people started to slow down there's some of us that kept on running somebody said i kept on running someone say i stuck with it and you hit that point where you got that second win and you just finished the race. And this cleansing fast that we just came off, boy, did that not give us a second win. The testimonies that I've gotten already because of that fast. But that fast really refreshed us because so much was broken off of us. And so much has been broken off of you since you've been under the anointing here on this channel. Through the grace of God, glory to God, amen. But God says... When it comes to your kingdom marriage, that your spouse is standing on the sideline, watching and rooting and enjoy and so proud of you. Because a lot of the times our blessings are waiting on us, like our sister Ruth, right? Boaz, Boaz already had the field. Boaz was already ready, right? And also, I'm sure God had prepared Boaz in some ways as well, but... This all came about from a, a dream that I had last night, and I'm so grateful for our dreams. All dreams come from God. Remember that. Good, bad, ugly dreams. You're like, why am I dreaming of this? Why am I dreaming of that? God is letting you know what's going on in the spiritual realm. That's it. Even a bad dream. And that is something we learned in a PD society circle. Even if in the dream there's a witch chasing you or something like that, it's not a bad dream. It's not a nightmare. It's God just showing you entities and things around you. Kingdom spouses trying to have sex with you in a dream, right? That's an incubus spirit. We learn about these things. Um, and they're trying to have sex with you. You have to know how to fight off and war off these spirits. But nevertheless, I had a beautiful dream last night. And there was this woman and she was running and running and running and running. And she was almost to the finish line. She was so tired. And her spouse was standing there and he was watching her and he was so happy. And he was so proud like, oh man, my wife is really about to cross this finish line. And a lot of the husbands are prepared and you just got to keep on going. And a lot of the husbands already know, but they're just waiting for you to show up as that beautiful version of yourself, not full of insecurities and fears and overthinking and low self-esteem, right? Men want confident women who know who they are, not only in Christ, but just know who they are in general and know their worth. And so that was a dream that I have. But God says, go ahead and finish the race. You shall finish strong and your spouse is on that sideline no matter what the hell it took maybe it rained during that race maybe it snowed maybe you wanted to give up a million times but because you finished that race race and you become this mature one of a woman of god right age doesn't matter when we talk about the spiritual world but you become that mature woman of god who is humble who's able to be broken right who was able that god was able to break a humble and become who you are today. And he renewed you. I'm happy for you guys. If you feel led to so into this word, hashtag the finish line. Your kingdom marriage is waiting on you and your spouses as well. Super happy for you guys. See you on the line. Bye-bye.